if you look at the big map, All right. uh, due south, basically due south of our lodge, there's a tower stand. Yeah. And that is where we are headed. One looks like an exclamation point. Nope. Oh. No, there's the exclamation point, um, and farther south than that, down right at the edge of the water. I see it. I just clicked the dot on it. Okay. All right. Alrighty, and well, away we go. Get cracking here. Yeah. And basically, we'll want it, once we get up to the start of the road here, we'll want to hit a crouch because we could hit red deer anywhere along the way. Alright. And those vicious hay bales. Yeah, we've got two pheasants, about, oh, 90 yards out. They're on the road going into that field. Yeah, I see them. Yeah, I don't think I have that kind of range. <laughs> that one on the left's kind of big. Yeah. I figured we could probably sneak up on them. What am I seeing back there? Oh, just a leaf, okay. Oh, we had, saw a red dealer on the hill there. More geese. Yeah. yeah, they're just chilling out. Yeah, a female and a male. Male's good size. I mean, yeah. I actually had to do a double take because he looks so much bigger than her. Good God, guys, you're kind of spooking things. <laughs> yeah, it says he could potentially score a 16 to a 27. Um, for me, he's 58 meters out right now. Hmm. Tempting. Well, we should be able to get closer to him. Yeah, the geese are flying in really weird formations now. What's your ideal range? Uh, I would say about 30 or 40. Alright, well I'm at 40 from him right now. Okay, let me see where you are. There we go. Because yeah, I don't have the scope. Huh. Well, you would move right now. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, I've got 37 yards on him for my location. shot this a distance yet, that far All distance. Right. So I'm gonna have to practice a little bit. This is yep, quiet. 30, 36 meters. Yep, you're over him again. You miss with the next one and I get to try with my compound. He's 34 out now, moving towards us, 33. 32, 31. Crazy, you gonna come right up and give us a kiss? 27, 26. <laughs> he is gonna walk right up and you better shoot him in the face. He's coming for you, man. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Alright. You just ducked. Why don't you give it a shot? Try I've gotta learn these sights a little bit better. You know, I can see him with the binoculars, but I cannot see him without the binoculars. Hmm. Now I can't see him at all. Where the, where the heck did he go? Oh, there, oh, okay, yeah, he flattened. Alright, I see him. God. Alright, which is the dot on this one that works? 
the above one or the top one or the bottom one, I forget. The deer it's a little easier. Oh, oh by golly, I missed him too. Practice range. <laughs> Where you nope, I missed him. <laughs> hmm. You trying to get the female? Yeah, yeah, I missed her though. Yep, I'm shooting just over her back. Not proving ourselves to be the great white hunters today. Yeah. There, I shot in front of her. The freaking geese are asking for it. I'll tell you what. No one, I'm not sure where you were. Guess what? what? We, <laughs> we both, both hit her, her apparently. Seriously? Yeah, I can see... What the heck? I can see two crossbow bolts through her and my arrow. I'm recording. You'll be able to see it when I put it up. Oh, I see like one, two, three, four of them sticking out of her. What the hey? That's pretty wacky. But it's, it, it says it's me. more like one of those fish that we have <laughs> flopping around. <laughs> yeah, I took a trophy shot in it because she's got so many in her. Yeah, there's definitely something going on with the servers because it means you hit her twice before I hit her. Uh, yeah. That's... Maybe we should stick with the big game for now. <laughs> yeah, something is wackified, that's for sure. Yeah, I think if we ease on up here, I mean, we're just going in the direction we need to go, so... Yeah. Just ease on up here and see if maybe we can get eyes on him, call him in. There really ought to be rabbits here, too. Yeah. I agree wholeheartedly with that. You can't tell me that in Germany they don't hunt rabbits. <laughs> awesome pepper, please. Yeah. Alright, right straight out, 139 yards, just dropped a dot. Walking crossways, I will see about my beeper. Let's see, here it is. I'll beep him a couple times and drop a patch of scent if, if he doesn't. Yeah, that, that that's me calling. I thought I heard an echo. I didn't know if it was him. Yeah, yeah, there was a funny echo. But uh, he's 156 yards out. He's walking across to the right. Now he's starting. Oh, he just turned in this direction. All right, I'm going to switch over to my uh, scent and uh, drop some scent. Decentification is up to par. Still got 14 minutes. Yeah, there is a weird echo. Yeah, he's coming straight at us, dude. <laughs> Alright, now he turned away. That's kind of weird. He was trotting straight at us, and then at 110 yards, he just turned, 
turned around and went the other direction. He's got some nice little horns on him. I, pr I can hit, I mean, if we can get him up here, I can shoot him at him prone, because I've got a little clear spot here. That was him. Yeah. Hmm. It's not gonna rain, is it? Oh, just sun behind the clouds. Did he give up? No, well, he's moving away from us. Now he's turning again. He's 122 yards out. He's moving towards us, but to our left. Yeah. But he's working his way in now. If he gets within 100 yards, he'll definitely pick up the scent. I'll drop another bop of the scent and call a couple more times. Well, the way these guys are, once he hits that smell... Well, that's just it. I mean, once he's on it, he should come straight in without hesitation. I see him. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go prone, crawl over by you and, and spot your distances. Okay. Alright, I'm right next to you now. Ninety-three, still moving this way. <clears throat> now on those notches, this one has three. What's the bottom one? Twenty, then thirty, then forty as you go up. Probably, yeah, probably twenty, thirty, forty could be twenty, twenty, forty, sixty. But I don't know because your other one goes in increments of ten yards, doesn't it? I think so, yeah. Yeah, 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 I think it goes like uh, 20, 30, 40, 50. So I would assume it's the same. He's uh, 70, 68. But the closer he gets, the better, of course. Oh, yeah, definitely. But he's definitely moving this way down. He's got some nice horns on him. They're really tall. Taller than I'm used to seeing. He's at uh, 58 now. Notch. 52, 51, 50. You're gonna get a really nice angle shot on him. Yeah. Get a nice pocket shot. Oh, he turned directly towards me. He's walking straight at me. He's walking almost straight at me too. Yeah. He's just hit 40 yards. All right. Now with the metal dot. Yeah. 37, 36. 35, 4, 3, two. yep, 2, 1, nice yeah. shot right in his head. <laughs> oh. You shot him right through his face. Now while I often say, come here, dear, I'm going to shoot you in the face, I don't generally actually shoot them in the face. <laughs> <laughs> I actually did it. Yeah. Okay, where'd he go? He's, He's still running. I got eyes on him. I see him too. He's not running very well. Yeah, he's running kind of odd. 138 meters and stop running. Gonna, I think he's going to go down. He's moving real slow. Yeah, he's yeah. having a hard time of it. He's not in the woods yet. Or I should say out of the woods yet. Yeah. Oh, and there was a female red deer that just called. I think he's getting ready to go down. He's just standing there. Eyeballs back on him. Yeah, he's... He's just hanging. Putting an arrow through your brain would do that. <laughs> yeah. Now he's, he's headed off to the left. There, he went down. He went see, down I still see him walking. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I do too. Shoot. Now he's paused. His legs are buckling a little bit. Uh, at least got the dot on him. Well, if we ease up, might be able to get eyes on him and give you some idea of what he looks like. Yeah. Oh yeah, we got oh my three Lord. three females out there in the field and him. Like this one. He's one, two, three, four females in him. He's a 59. I don't know what that means for old deer. Actually, that's a pretty dandy score for a for a roebuck. I think I could.
could be completely wrong. Oh, wow. Yeah. So back behind us... Is that a male or a female? That's a female. So we got a female on the hill back behind us, and then we've got the four females and male out there in the field. Oh, good God. So you can see this is definitely the time of day for him. I'd say. All right, well, let's uh, ease up here to the edge of the field, and I'll bust out my call. See if we can pull that big old fella over here. We may have to knock down a couple of these females. I don't want them to see me like this. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to drop some scent. And do some calls. Alright, so the four of them just turned towards us. Yeah, he's still... He, yeah, he's out of sight. Let's see, that one's 117. 113. That one's 94. Yeah, what I'm going to do is go prune as well, and once again get where I can spot for you. Yeah, the, the leftmost is at about 88, then we've got in the 90s for the middle two, and that other female is about 109, and still no sign of him. Well, he may notice that he doesn't have his harem with him, and he might turn around and come back. Yeah. If not, we'll certainly get on his track. Is that you? Nope. That was one of the females. You never know. He might give a holler again and give away his position. Uh huh. Getting strange rays from the sun. Yes, yeah. Okay, the leftmost one is 53 meters out right now. Next one to the right is 63, then 85, and 84. She is now 44, for 43, 42, 40. She's going to walk right up and kiss us on the nose. Let's take her out without her running if we can do it. <laughs> On the spot. There you go. Very nice. The other two closest one of them is at 50. 48.7. 46. Shoot, those two are close together. Yeah. 40. You'll, you'll want to take the one at the front. She's at 36 and paused. Nice shot. Down she went. <laughs> Next one is at 45, 43, 41. Is that the buck over there? 40. Or another female. The, the buck, buck is far, the one farthest to the right. He is 85 meters out. He is a nice one too. All right, the closest female is 27. Nice. You hit her and Shoot. she dropped. And spooked the other two. Damn it. Yeah. He went to the right, and she went to the left. Yep. Dang, man. <coughs> Took them all down, too, and still spooked them. Yep. Yeah, I think I think that crossbow has got a little larger spook radius than, than the other one or something. Because you hit her, and she dropped down the spot. Her knees buckled, and then she dropped. That's quite a pile there. <laughs> I'm starting to do it. Apparently it's just the pheasants that like to make fun of me. Yeah. Alright, well, you police those up. I'll just ease out here and see if I can pick up his track. I'm just gonna hope he work. <laughs> okay, I hit her right in the s neck and the spine, both. Oh, shoot. That female came up behind me. Oh, that one that was back across the hill? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see, I think the 
these are all the tracks of the females there. And did he go out to? Well, we know he went back behind that hill. So if I go over there and I pick up his track, then I should spot domes. Okay, he was being a lot more cautious. He's like, the, you girls go check it out. I'll stay back here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Call Mr. Brave and all. <laughs> Hit her in the brain. Yeah, I'm just not sure which track is his. Because I think I uh, ended up picking up one of the females somewhere along the line. That's interesting to note, though. So if I shot her on the third one... Those must be more than... I shot a little high, so I need to aim a little bit lower than I've been aiming. Okay. Hmm. See, I don't know where he where he ran when he ran. So I've picked up a fleeing track here, so I think that's probably him. Yeah, because he he ran right that where you are. Okay. The female ran across the road and did the other side. Okay. Well, then I'm, I see another track that potentially belongs to him right here. 